Vlogs, and today we're gonna do something super easy but amazing. I'm gonna show you how to make all the chicken girl bracelets. So if you're a fan of Annie or Hayden, or if you can't stop watching the show, stay around so you can learn how to accessorize like a true chicken girl. Here are the materials we're gonna need. Some black beads, orange beads, white beads, red beads, and yellow beads. Some stretchy bead cord, and we're also gonna need some alpha beads. So we're gonna start with Rhyme's bracelet. Listen up now. Rhyme is probably my favorite chicken girl because I love Annie LeBlanc. Hey, I think this is yours. So for Rhyme's bracelet, we're gonna need white, orange, red, and black. I'm gonna start with the C and the G. I have to put the G first, then the C. It's like a five minute craft. Now we're gonna keep on doing that pattern. Orange, red, white, and black. Keep doing it until you fill out the bracelet. And guys, what do you think? Should Ryan choose TK or Tim? Comment down below. Now we're gonna tie knot and it will be ready. I'm sorry if I sound a little stuffy. It's because I'm, I'm a little sick, so. Okay guys, it's ready. Now I'm a true chicken girl. So now we're gonna make Ellie's bracelet. You're gonna need a orange C, a green G, red, yellow, and white beads. First you have to put the orange or red C. Then I put in the green G. Guys, do you think Ali should have picked her singing career in Malibu? Or do you think she should stay with her friends in Attaway? What would you do? I love how she sings. She has such a beautiful voice, even better than mine. So now we're just repeating the same pattern until we're done. Okay, we're done with Ellie's bracelet and I think it came out amazing, so I'm gonna put them on. Now we are doing Kayla's bracelet. The pattern is difficult, but it's not something that we can't accomplish. So we have the CG, but they're both in black, and I'll just help you along the way. The colors are beige, orange, white, and yellow. So let's just start. I'm starting with the C for chicken, and then the G for girls. So the pattern starts with beige, White, beige, then yellow, white, beige, white, orange. That is the pattern that I got. So let's keep on going with the bracelet. So we are done with Kayla's bracelet and it came out really nice. It has beautiful and soft colors. Well now I'm gonna put all the bracelets in. So we're about to do Quinn's bracelet, but we don't have any more green Gs, so we're gonna use a blue G. And the C is red or orange. So let's start. I'm putting in the C first. And I love Quinn's bracelet. I think it's my favorite. It's really cool. Most of the bracelet is actually white. So after I'm done with the white, I'm gonna add a yellow and three oranges. I love how this one turned out, it's exquisite. So these were the four bracelets from the Chicken Girls. You can wear them all together or give three of them to your friends. Let me know in the comments down below which Chicken Girl is your favorite. After making all these Chicken Girl bracelets, I sort of want to make my own Lock Squad bracelet. Let's just start. So I put in the L and now I'm putting in the S. 
I'm gonna do three pink beads, one blue bead. I'm gonna do 15 white now. One blue, now three pinks, and I'm done with my Lock Squad bracelet. And it looks super good, I love it! So, as I said in my last video, I'm gonna be picking three random names. All of you that commented the three clues are in this bowl. Before we start, I have to give a shout out to Kenzie McCabe Lover. Because last week I forgot to give her a shout out. My little dude here is gonna help me pick out the names. Pick the first one. The first one is BAA Life. The next one is Hanging Out with Mary So. And the last one is Jeffrey Moore. You all get a shout out. Big kiss to all of you. If you guys make your own lock squad bracelet, make sure to tag me on your photo of your bracelet on Instagram. And I'll give you a shout out. I love you guys so, so much. See you next time.